Hey guys, so it's Saturday. I didn't really get to vlog too much this week as I'm still kind of getting everything back on schedule and um, trying to wrap up my bed frame build and things like that. But I did want to update you of everything that I've been doing this week in terms of exercise. So on Tuesday, I was in New York City um, going to a concert and had a good time. I got to watch Eric Nam, uh, which is a great artist if you don't know who it is. Um, he's a K-pop artist, sings Korean and also English. I'm showing you some of the footage from the show now. Um, it was definitely a great time. So before the show, Nelson and I got about three miles in, walking around the city. I didn't really record it because it was a couple hours of kind of like going around, having dinner, things like that. So I didn't really record the um, the map on that. Wednesday, I continued to do some of the bed frame um, building as well. Thursday, I was able to get a mile in at work. I've been slowly trying to get a little bit more consistent with those uh, quick miles during lunch. Um, sometimes I, you know, I don't remember to map it and things like that, but try to just stay consistent with that. And yesterday, Friday, I was able to spend a little bit more than an hour playing racquetball with uh, my friends Nelson and Scott, which was pretty awesome. So we just finished a racquetball session with the actual rules this time because you know that we've never played with the rules. Teach them. Right? It worked out. I lost every single game. <laughs> that's why I play That's why I play alone. I always win when I play alone. Um, so yeah, we just had a good time, exercise, got some sweats in. I feel good. I'm tired, right? Oh yeah. It's good enough. I think it was like an hour and something. Like an hour and a half at least. Yeah. Alright, so I'll check you guys soon. See ya. And today, Saturday, I just continued to work on some things with my bed frame. I was able to actually transport it over to my apartment and start getting everything together. And I'll be releasing a video on kind of the whole process on that um, once I am have slept in the mattress that I bought for a few weeks and, and see if I still enjoy it and show you how I pretty much put everything together. So it's Sunday, and today I actually did a quick uh, 1.45 mile um, outside and the good thing is is that I tried to add a little bit of running in that uh, in that walk it's a great feeling to go from you know just a, over a month ago having issues with just being able to walk a certain distance to now being able to do a mile you know without a problem and also starting to feel the energy to add a little bit of running in that in that time as well so I eventually want to add more and more running in my uh, my exercising. So once I get a little bit more uh, comfortable, I will be doing that. And I also want to eventually do a 5K. A friend of mine actually told me that he would be interested in doing a 5K with me, so I might take him up on that offer in the next month or two. And of course, I'll let you know uh, when I'm doing that. And next is going to be the weigh-in. So I just weighed in, um, that was at 266.4, last week was 268.8. So the good thing is is that um, I'm being consistent with uh, the weight loss. I think it's it's about 2 pounds a week or 2.3 or 2.4 a week. It's at a comfortable rate. You know, I'm not doing anything too extreme. I am still, you know, eating on a daily basis as I should, trying to stay active. I can't tell you that I've been 100% on, you know, making the right decisions on food, but I would say 80 to 90 percent of the time I have been choosing the healthier option um, you know if I go out to dinner I try to choose the grilled chicken and jasmine rice instead of like a, a bacon burger um, you know if I am at a restaurant and all they do have is sandwiches or something and you know I feel like oh, okay I've done well this week you know I am getting like a grilled chicken sandwich and a, you know a side of fries or whatever but it's it's choosing the better option, choosing the option that I would have not normally chosen before this process and just trying to stay consistent, you know, eating fruits, having vegetables and salad, um, grilled chicken, yogurts, tuna, um, you know, baked potato, chili, stuff like that. Um, eating stuff that I actually like still, which is good, 
and not trying to pressure myself too much, but just being consistent with eating healthy and trying to stay active as much as I can. First week was a little bit uh, more intense. I had nothing on my schedule, so it was easier to come home and make meals and prep for the week and exercise every day. Um, it's a little bit more in the normal process now with the schedule and, and having things that I have to do, so I'm not able to do as much as I did on my first week, but still trying my best to get around everything and, um, and, and stay active. Good news is, is that we're staying consistent, we're still losing weight, and I'll catch you next week.